Hi. Hi. Hi to everybody. Uh, good morning to all those people that are following us uh, in North America. And uh, good afternoon to all the people that are attending to this conference on this side of the Atlantic. We are more than 850 people attending this conference. This conference is organized by the International Foundation on Big Data and Artificial Intelligence for Human Development. And this conference is focused on a crucial issue for everybody. It is how can we measure the extreme climate events. And this is also the key factor to understand the real character of this foundation, to put together the scientific community and the business community to identify instruments to improve the quality of human development. But let me start from the very beginning. Uh, I am Patricia Bianchi. My name is Patricia Bianchi, and I am a scientific director of this foundation. And now I think that we have to answer to the question, what is that, this foundation? Who are the participants? And which are the main objectives? OK, I think that we can send this short video explaining why we want this foundation and what is that, this foundation. Please, the video. The Big Data and Artificial Intelligence for Human Development Foundation, IFAB, is promoted by the Emilia-Romagna region and was set up to consolidate and supplement Italy's science and technology expertise, supporting the revitalization of the entire European production system in the process. IFAB's mission is to promote the development of big data and artificial intelligence technologies and innovative scientific methods which can be used to drive sustainable human development. IFAB was founded in Bologna, at the center of the Emilia-Romagna region's high-tech network, which consists of 10 technopoles and 88 laboratories and industrial research centers. Since the early 60s, Italy's scientific high-performance computing expertise has been concentrated in Bologna. Currently active here is Marconi 100, the Italian HPC Tier 0 system, forming with the Tier 0 systems of France, Germany, Spain and recently Switzerland, the European HPC Prace infrastructure. Leonardo, a new highly powerful pre-exascale supercomputer, will also be developed here by 2022. Leonardo is the pre-exascale system procured by Euro HPC, outcome of the European effort to control HPC technology, co-designed by Chineka and Atos, integrating Partec modular computing software stack, which will be installed and maintained by E4 Engineering, the HPC SME headquartered in Emilia-Romagna region. The founding partners of IFAB include the Big Data Association, which brings together the regional universities and the main Italian research bodies involved in the development of technologies based on high-performance computing, big data and AI. Regional institutions. National research institutions. National consortia, research centers and foundations universities. IFAB's founders also include a number of leading companies like Unipolsai and ENI, while others are about to join. Finally, another of IFAB's partners is Atos, European leader in the fields of cloud solutions, cybersecurity and high-performance computing. The composition of the foundation is consistent with its mission of integrating the research system with the production system of large, medium-sized and small businesses. 
The International Scientific Board is the body that guides the actions of the Foundation, envisaging medium and long-term scenarios regarding the development of science and technology in response to the challenges of the new millennium. Members of the Board Ursula Basler Patrizio Bianchi Matteo Valero Cortes Luciano Floridi Anna Grassalino Thomas Lippert Florence Rabier Alec Ross Alberto San Giovanni Vincentelli IFAB scientific activities are supported by four working groups focused on four major areas. Conventional and innovative technologies, socio-economic challenges, climate change, life science and precision medicine. A number of projects consistent with these research areas are ongoing. The first of these is the Big Data and AI for Climate Change Analysis for the development of European Extreme Events Climate Index, a tool which can be used by different economic operators to define climate risk evaluation and coverage strategies. The second project is Big Data for Data Society, the case of Human Habitat Management Project. It is focused on identifying operating platforms for managing mobility in large urban systems. The goal of the Quantum Technologies project is to define the functional answers that high-performance computing may provide, both on pre-exascale systems and on systems based on the most recent quantum advancements. The aim is supporting the scientific and production system in the transition towards quantum technologies. The BBC project focuses on big code, a new way of conceiving software based on AI and ML techniques and taking advantage of the first institutional European mirror of the Software Heritage Archive, the largest open source SW archive in the world, hosted at the ENIA Research Centre in Bologna. The multidisciplinary nature of the projects reflects the composition of the Foundation itself and the context in which it operates. In fact, the Big Data Technopole hosts numerous entities which can take advantage of the high-performance computing services supplied by the current Marconi 100 and the future Leonardo supercomputer. Here at the Technopole, the scientific and business community will be able to make use of the Marconi National Laboratories, advanced laboratories for carrying out research into new production and service activities, downstream from high-performance computing. A founding pillar of a national and international network of application laboratories. The Big Data Technopole has also been proposed as the headquarter of one of the institutions of the United Nations University, dedicated to the application of big data and artificial intelligence for the management of changes to the human habitat. The result is an ecosystem in which research is transformed into innovative capacity that can revitalize European development and identify tangible new solutions for the goals established by the United Nations. An infrastructure dedicated to global development with IFAB the meeting point between the technological potential of high-performance computing, sustainable development according to the guidelines of Europe and the United Nations, the management of the territory and of an increasingly complex society, investment and production possibilities in the business world. In fact, only through the interaction and integration of these systems is it possible to rise to the challenges of the present and construct a better future.